All right, y'all. Boat's been in the shop for a year. Haven't been fishing in forever. Don't know where the fish are or nothing. Um, but we're gonna try out here. Came over here on a tip, but be honest with you, I feel like I should be on the other side of this lake. Yeah, I don't know about this. I think I'm gonna take one more cast and then I'm gonna have to move. Let's make a choice. Either we go in the grass or we go towards the pass. Or we just pick up and haul ass across this lake, which is what I might do. Let's try something in this little bayou here. This little bayou seems to be deep. I saw a uh, shrimp popping in it. Something hit me. What I got? I got a fish on there. Feels like a decent sized fish. That might be a speckle trout. Oh yeah, I like a keeper too. All right, all right. I think we're in business. All right. Whew. We got one. Let's see how big he is. Well, he's 12 all day long. Oh, yeah. He's 12. That's one. Since I lost my other towel, I gotta use this towel. Ooh, I got an idea. Let's spray some anise on it. They love the anise. I'm gonna spray some of that on there. All right. Should be game on now, let's see. I think there's a bunch of specks right up in this area over here. When I came in, they got a pond over there and a pond over here with a canal connecting the two. And uh, the canal's a little deep because there's a lot of run water running through it. And as I was passing through, I saw a shrimp. So I figured why not give it a try. And now we're on a little, a little bite, a little bite. But uh, we got the popping cork out there with a little paddle tail on it. Let's see if we can't catch something with that. And the tide's coming in right now still. My little tide line is starting to disappear over there. I wonder if the tide's changing on me right when I get here. That's how it normally happens. What we got? That's a speck. He might be a small one though. Probably a small one. But that's all right, we're making progress. No, that's a keeper. That might be a keeper. All day long. Might be a keeper all day long, let's see. Stop moving. That's a male. It's a little male speckled trout. Cause uh, you can hear him croaking. Oh yeah, he's 12, all day, that's two.
two fish. Oh yeah, another speck. If the other one was a keeper, this one's gotta be a keeper. Big mamma jamma. That's a big mamma jamma. Let it go. Let it go, mamma jamma. Oh yeah, he's good. He's good. I got lucky with this overcast. Overcast is gonna extend the bite a little bit. If that sun was to pop out, I would probably be better off going home, but we're gonna find out what this overcast can do for us. Oh yeah, that's another speck. I think I'm on a little honey hole here. Ooh. It's looking good. It is looking good today. He swallowed the hell out of it. Well, you're coming home, so. All day long. I'm gonna do something here. Ooh, missed another one. That means he's about to bite it again. Got him. Got him. He feels small though. He feels he feels a little small, but we gotta measure him <laughs> to be sure because uh, we we don't know. History has told us that we need to measure this. <laughs> Okay. Oh, he's 12. Yeah, he's another good one. One, two, three, five. We got five. History has told us we need to measure these fish. Another one. Oh, he let go. He let go. Take it again. Take it again, dude. It's right there, ready for the picking. Boom. Got him. Got him again. These fish are not big, but they're 12. They are 12. Except this one, he might be small. Ah, don't move. Yeah, he ain't gonna make it. We're gonna let this one go. Whoops. Let him go.
Ah! He swallowed that one. That's an, ooh, he's jumping. That's a nice one. That's a nice one. He's gonna keep. That's for sure. Ooh. Probably the biggest one yet. Tell you what, you're gonna have to go get your friends for me. Go get your friends. I wanna show y'all that one. See, that's a nice one. He's, he's probably about 15 maybe, you know? Boom! <laughs> oh, he let go. He let go. Why'd you do that, dude? Got him. Oh, we got him. Stay on, big daddy. Stay on. Yeah, he's so good. We're gonna get him in a boat and see what he does. Come on, dude. That's a keeper. That's gonna be a keeper. See, they gotta be 12 inches, y'all. Gotta measure your fish. And he is way over 12. Today I rode around and I hit probably about 10 spots before I found this one. Tide didn't stop moving, but it did slow down. I think this bite's over. It's time to move. Time to move. Conditions changed, the sun came out, the winds picked up. Water's barely moving right here, so it's time to go somewhere else. We tried about a good 15, 20 spots today. Wound up with seven speckled trout which is seven more than I thought I was gonna catch because I haven't been out here in a year. Last time I came out here was uh, October last year. But uh, I think we had some success right there. Only thing is the sun's out real bright. When the sun comes out like that, speckled trout, they just, they just shut down. And all the salt water, we've been having killed all the grass, so redfish are kind of hard to find. I think we're gonna call it a day right here. We know what's going on, we know what to look for next time. And uh, if you like the video, hit the subscribe button down below, leave a comment, have some fun with it. And uh, we're gonna come out here another time, probably tomorrow, might be out here tomorrow. And uh, we're gonna see if we can do a little bit better than seven. So have a good day. See you later.